Blessed are the saints of God, both now and for eternity. The book of Revelation shows us that, that so beautifully in, in the way that God has cared for his people, he, how he has sent his son to redeem and to promise them an eternity, free from, from the pain and the struggle and the disease and the want of this world. We hear that so beautifully in, in Revelation chapter 7, our, our first reading for this coming Sunday. I'll read just a portion of that of that lesson. These are they who have come out of the great tribulation. They have washed their robes, made them white in the blood of the Lamb. Therefore they are before the throne of God and serve him day and night in his temple. And he who sits on the throne will spread his tent over them. Never again will they hunger, never again will they thirst. The sun will not beat upon them, nor any scorching heat, for the Lamb at the center of the throne will be their shepherd. He will lead them to springs of living water, and God will wipe away every tear from their eyes. This is the word of the Lord. We say thanks be to God. We pray, Almighty and merciful God, you are our only source of health and healing. Only you can bring calmness and peace to our lives. So grant to us, your children, a consciousness of your presence and a strong confidence in you. In our pain, weariness, and anxiety, surround us with your care. Protect us by your loving might. And permit us once more to enjoy health and strength and peace. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. May God continue to bless your week.